In the previous video, I show how to create patient record and appointment with OpenEMR. Now uh, let's continue and I will try to show some more advanced uh, features which is available within OpenEMR. And first of all, login with our uh, physician account. Have created previous uh, video. And search and select same patient as I will work in with. For example, this way I can select patient or I can do it through calendar if it's like today it's my first day in work week. So same way I can click and select my patient. So if necessary, I can make changes for patient data like demographic or so. And um, if I now have more information about patient, I can provide some kind of historical uh, historical information about or what is could be more important. I can assign now medical problem which is observed for the long term like chronic diseases and uh, others or allergies or uh, what kind of vaccination uh, provided for this patient uh, uh, and so on. Actually, it will be also in your task and listed on the topic name, but topic 10. But before it, uh, I will show how to work with encounter, which is actually main part of uh, patient medical record and will consist most information regarding all clinical cases which happens with this patient. So review of past encounter we can see on the, on the list of encounters. And right now I want to add one more, one more create new encounter. I can do it from, uh, from open encounter or I can create it like uh, throw create visit. So I will follow this way this time. The result will be exactly the same. Uh, so right now I have a visit for today and system refer me to existing encounter, but but I prefer create new one. I prefer create new one. So I will um, choose it for tomorrow even and assign as new visit. So most important to have a signet visit category as a hand, you will not be able to create encounter. Okay, I can make some notice like what's caused with it. However, that's but um, you must understand that it's not clinical, that it's just clinical notes, not like components of actual uh, health history. Let's say. This time I have pay of encounter and I'm already entered in tomorrow's encounter. So what is most important on the encounter it's section colored forms. We have we can assign multiply form for encounter and within form we can uh, we can have multiply information like to provide fee information or billing option or we can create, for example, like subject objective form and where it's which this time represent form of medical documentation. And we have like, uh, we can fill information like about subjective observation, not feelings, objectively we can make like um, so. Fever. We consider we observe the fever. Uh, um, temperature about um, 39 degrees of Celsius. So assessment like modern time. Covid 29 positive positive. And 
the recommendation what this what uh, should be provided provided for this patient uh, and so on after that as you can see a form being added into encounter record and we can review it update if necessary and so on same way we can update encounter itself so working uh, on encounter tightly related to question uh, like issues noun issue so we can add the um, information about noun issue which is uh, like observing on a regular basis or uh, so we can do it from uh, this window or from main patient window so we have multiply approach uh, like to work to work in with as you can see automatically will be added icd10 coders for my for my observation i can use modern time or i can choose my past information if i have past history of this patient and i can assign past date and so on so this time i have uh, like i see uh, i am assigning a medical issue for this patient in general so when i will get into patient uh, record so and refresh it so here is as you can see new record being added into medical problems but also particularly this one uh, this medical problems are signed to this particular um, encounter too uh, if i will continue with uh, advanced features additional information about other information so i can add information about immunization or allergies so i am already added the uh, information about past medical problems so something more let's add something more for example allergies very easy from patient card i can add known allergy for example could be in also for me shown uh, active issues which is available and i can add information when it was uh, last time first time observed or any other uh, necessary information okay same way i can add the other uh, more information about when i go back to my patient patient record or i can try um, add the noun immunization which were provided with them uh, okay for example this one So for me given code, when it's been completed, even if it was done in the, in the past, I can use past date and save my information. So again, all, inf all information will be mm, collected within mm, patient record same way um, as i mentioned before in previous video we can information about we can review existing clinical reminders if it's necessary add uh, such information um, uh, if it's necessary uh, so more information as i told you can get from documentation which is available for free at uh, open your mark media website and i will add it into um, comment for this video it's all that i want to talk please take screen of all your work you have done and send that as attachment collect within one folder for example on your google drive and share with me to provide the review or for example you can use google doc so provide our screens with your notice about which parts of task have you completed from given list thank you for your attention